Hey everyone, my name is Udit. Today I'm going to talk a little bit about the program management interview that typically comes up in Google's TPM on-site interview loop. At the end of this video, you should have a pretty good understanding of what to expect in this interview, what your interviewers are looking for, and a couple of tips on how to prepare for it. As a quick intro, I'm from Prepfully. We offer anonymous mock interviews with someone who's worked in your target company and role, along with a host of other interview prep services. So in this context, we've got a lot of Google TPMs who've been helping candidates with mocks and advice and who've put together relevant content, this video being an example of it. So on to the program management interview. In a nutshell, this interview focuses on your ability to demonstrate core program management competencies. The first is an execution focus. So how you come up with an execution strategy, make prioritization calls, organize program kickoffs, isolate and mitigate risks, and eventually drive and measure impact. The second is how you manage stakeholders. So how you influence them, achieve alignment and strategy, synthesize key insights, and then drive regular communication. Questions for both of these usually follow the how do you X format or tell me about a time format. For instance, how do you make prioritization trade-offs? What are the factors you look at? How do you weigh them against one another? Or how do you handle a long running program that's well over budget? Or for the sort of questions focusing on your past experience, you could get asked, tell me about a time where you had to switch tactics mid-program. How did you manage the people involved? Who did you communicate these changes to, etc.? Or give me an example of a time where you had to set KPIs for a system. What would you do differently if you had to do it all over again? What did you learn in the process? So in all these questions, don't just forget that it's not just about the execution you need to talk about, but also the stakeholders involved and how you managed and interacted with them. On a much broader level though, I have five tips that are particularly important when interviewing for Google. First, Google interviewers rate you on four metrics across all interviews. And we've got a separate video talking about these in more detail. But this interview weighs particularly strongly on the general cognitive ability or what's known as GCA and role related knowledge or RRK scores. So make sure that you demonstrate both your program management skills as well as any team or role specific knowledge that you might be expected to be aware of. Secondly, TPMs at Google are faced with numerous problems that need solving and that they own. Uh, and this interview is going to look explicitly for your competence in pulling this off. So make sure that you have both some stories ready to show when you've done it in the past and also some ideas on how you might do it for the theoretical challenges that get thrown at you. Which brings me to my third tip. Whenever possible, rather than talking just about theoretical actions you might take, try to give an example of what you actually did in a similar situation you might have faced in the past. This both grounds your answer in reality and as a useful side effect demonstrates that you really do have the skills and the experience in facing different scenarios of this sort. Fourth, have at least one example of when you manage a program end to end, all the way from coming up with a strategy, gathering data to influence stakeholders into buying into the strategy, identifying solutions, prioritizing between them, uh, planning a roadmap with a scope, a time frame, a budget, and then driving execution forward on it. Fifth, and finally, practice. This is pretty much a universal tip across most of my videos, since there's no real replacement for this. And this role is becoming so incredibly competitive that however competent you might be at the actual job, you're going to struggle to articulate this when compared to other folks who've invested weeks into honing and practicing their answers and getting constant feedback to make them really crisp and sharp. So that's all from me. That's our guidance from Prefully on how to rock the Google TPM program management interview. Once you feel ready for some practice or just want a sense check of your preparation level, you can book an anonymous interview of this sort with a Google TPM on Prefully. There's a link in the description below. In addition, we've also linked to a bunch of useful resources for the Google TPM interview. There's a written guide which goes into more depth. There's also sample interview questions. There's a couple of blog posts which talk about the nuances of this and other interviews. So feel free to check those out as well. As always, if you have follow up questions about the interview, please ask in the comments below. And if you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks and good luck. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, please subscribe. Our website is prepfully.com. We've got lots of interview questions there. You can also schedule a mock interview with one of our experts. You can find the link in the description below. All the best from us at Prepfully, and we hope you totally rock your interview.